What's going on guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today I'm showing you how to install Roblox shaders using reshade into Roblox to make Roblox look way better. But before I start the video, I just want to inform you that using Roblox shaders on Roblox while recording with OBS does lag your recording. So I don't recommend using it if you want to just, if you don't have a great PC and you want to record videos with it. So yeah. With that out of the way, let's just get into how you get it. So, the first step is obviously having Roblox if you don't, but I'm assuming you already do, so that's out of the way. And if you don't, you can look up how to install it online, but I'm pretty sure you guys would. And the next step after that is to install Roblox Reshade. And basically the way to do that is just click the I think it's the second link in the description it'll take it to, to the to the file the media share file to install the zip folder you need to uh, you need to use and that Roblox zip folder not the Roblox zip folder that just zip folder will be this and once you have that installed you will just have this and you can look in your downloads and find the zip folder just this zip and yeah uh now the next step is to just run this run this file and press extract all because you need to extract all and for me it's saying you you already have files in that destination because i already have it installed so i'm just going to just replace the files in this destination but you guys don't have to do that you're gonna, you guys aren't going to have to do that, that's just for me. Okay, now you're going to be in here, and the reshade is now going to have an icon. Now you're going to open it, but before you do anything else, you're going to search up Roblox, and then um, on Roblox Player, do Open File Location. Now, with the Roblox Player, do Open File Location again, and now just copy this f file path just highlight it and press Control c or just copy now you can close this for now but just for now and now you can press select file location in here and then just paste it as i just did and then when you're in here just press roblox player beta.exe just click that it's not roblox player launcher do roblox player beta and now, when it's like the rendering API the game uses, just like tick OpenGL. Do you want to overwrite the existing installation or uninstall reshade? Since I already have it installed, um, and asking me this, so I'm just gonna press yes to overwrite. Do you wish to install a collection? Just press yes for this. But when it does that, trust me on this one. Press uncheck all. Just do that. Uncheck all, or else your game is gonna look really weird. And now press edit reshade settings. I already, I already have these two ticked, but it's performance mode and skip tutorial. You want to have those. You want to have those on skip tutorial and performance mode. And yes, now that you have both of those on, you can finally close this window. And now onto the uh, more exciting part, I guess. I don't know, but. Now just press Windows R and then paste what you have in your clipboard, the file location, into here again. And now what you'll want to do is just control click on 7 gears preset, open GL32 and reshade shaders. And just drag them into your version folder. And now It'll take a minute or two to complete, and then it's gonna say replace the files in this destination. Just do that for, and there you go. You have just installed Roblox shaders. Very simple, very easy, and yep. Now you just have it installed. And now what, I mean the next step basically is just to go into your browser Join Roblox. I'll be going into Arsenal. But just for show. 
Now, the la the recording is gonna lag because it does lag your recordings. As you can see, it said press home, but I'm just saying, um, having Roblox shaders does lag your recordings, and I'm gonna in uninstall it myself after this, so, like, my recordings from now on won't lag, but if, yeah, as I said before, if you're looking to, like, record videos with Roblox shaders, it's just not gonna work unless you have a great PC, and I don't have a great PC. So, um, even though my recording is lagging right now, basically what you're going to do is just press home, and then you have a whole list of things you can turn on, you can experiment around with it, magic bloom, lots of types of things, there's like, uh, pers perfect perspective, I don't even know what that does, but, but there's all these effects that you can, um, uh, mess around with reflective bump mapping that makes things look reflective apparently but there's all of these things and you can that you can mess around with that change the coloring that change basically everything you can think of to make it look way better than it already is um, and yes performance mode is ticked over here if you don't think you need performance mode you can untick it but if you don't have a great PC like mine um, I recommend using performance mode anyways that's basically the video thanks for watching and like and subscribe i guess because we're trying to hit a thousand like if you found it informative and you got your shaders installed then like and subscribe you know i'm not gonna say turn on notifications like everyone else but just we're trying to hit a thousand by 2022 so owen can like sit on his head and drink water or something i don't know what he's gonna do but come on it's free and that's what I'm going to leave it at. So thanks for watching. Like and subscribe and bye.